what's up everybody today i am going to do a video of lego city first this is going to be the police set where a helicopter and a cop car will be chasing a robber's car stolen from the dealership so let's get started first here we go with the helicopter the things are really spinny and really hard to assemble when you break them so every time i break them or drop them sometimes i get a lot of trouble with it and i have to go be finding the instructions out of all my pile then we have the cockpit we have first the controls and then all the controls for air speed and velocity and here we have the controls to go left, right, and to the sides, and front and back. Then we have our winch right here. And I did this on my own. I just did this for a bit of fun. It's a bit of lights. And then from the inside, I did this by myself with some extra Lego pieces, a walkie-talkie stand, a little handlebar right here as you can see so you, they can grab on and they don't be falling off and here we go these which sometimes i like to put minifigures on so they can fit more things and that's mostly it and we have our winch and some handlebars up here so we'll be moving on next we have the robber's car we got the lights very fancy, but I didn't really like this, how they made it like this. They could have made it at least straight. It, it took some space out and a bit not very good. So I still want an improvement on that. Maybe I'll be fixing that in a later video. Next, we have the interior. They don't, it doesn't have much, just uh, the velocity and the gas, so I don't have very much to show on that. The steering wheel is very down, so I would like an improvement on that. There's not very much space in there, but we do have some extra things back here. We have the thing for the helicopter winch so it can grab onto the car, the robber's car. And back here we have a fancy design of the car. Next, we're gonna have the police car. It has very fancy lights, which I made. First, we have the interior. They did more detail on this one, and I would like an improvement, but it kinda has a bit of holes here, so. I kind of want an improvement. Maybe I'll change to that. Next, we have the back. It doesn't have very much. Just the lights and some extra detail that they made. The under of it, it's not very much, but it's something. The front, it doesn't have very much detail. That's what, something I wanted more. The sides are the same, but yeah. They didn't have very good stickers and everything. So we have blue and yellow. I wish they could have been white, but it's yellow. And that'll be it. Next, we have the cargo ship. First, the interior. This one didn't come as much detail. It only came with the driver's seat and the seat. Next, the wings. Here we have this. It kind of, and it moves a lot. And this actually is kind of cool where the detail is. And it has lights here, so that's pretty cool. And then, the back moves, but it has trouble breaking. Yeah, it has a lot of trouble breaking. Then back here, we have the whole cargo storage. 
Not much, but you can fit something. I would usually stuff minifigures in here. And it's not very much about it. And let's go with the last one. First, we have the spaceship. This is the opening of it. And I added an extra brick so it could hold together because mine would usually break break together so if somebody was looking for a solution there it is and this one my grandma bought it for me since she was leaving back to her home so I'm kind of sometimes sad when I play with it so that's a lot of good memories and back here we have the wings they look pretty cool it actually looks like a real spaceship I added these so it could look more realistic, so, and I think sometimes I pretend like if they were guns, like in Avengers, so, that's kind of using my imagination. Here back we have the, the detail of the boosters. Here they move, but don't do much, so. Sometimes they break off a lot if you just want to sit it there, so I had trouble with that. And that'll be it for this one. Next, we have the trailer with the commune. If this one doesn't have very much. The only problems are really the trailer that has trouble hooking up and breaking really easily. It doesn't have very much detail, but I also think it kind of looks like a real one. So, comment about that, what you think this is. So, and we'll see whoever has the most votes will, will be called whatever it was. Here we have this. The horns, I had to add extra pieces so it could hold together really well. If not, it would keep breaking. And back here, we have all the extensions things and the sleeper. Back here, the trailer. I put these lights extra because I actually liked them. They're blue and white, so if anybody was looking for an idea, here it is. The trouble with this is that it doesn't really connect and falls off. Here we have a mini storage thing, which I don't really even use. This breaks easily, so that's the really only trouble I have with it apart from that. The other one, apart from it, it's really solid. It has a really long thing, which sometimes I put mini figures on. And here we go with this. Um, kind of looks like a bed for me but it's not and back here we have the lights which isn't really much but i wish they could have added like a base plate or something so they could like put this on top and the so they could put the the plates so they could tell the numbers but they didn't well that looks like everything for today i see you in the next video bye